more of this hall will be filled with all the people your father influenced. I'm ready to jump into the business. I'm ready to straighten up, Tom. It's good to hear. It's good to say. You'll have a lot of people to convince. Well, Zuzu's been helping out with that. How did you two meet, anyway? In rehab. We both have kind of a foot fetish. <laughs> hey, who doesn't? <laughs> you gotta be kidding me. Who thought Clayton would ever go to rehab? So it's over then. What? It's all over. Minor league baseball. I mean, look at the way they're talking to each other. Looks like they just said makeup sex. It actually does look like that. <sighs> nice job, Porter. Hell of a year, man. We lose. You're actually better off, pal. That whole situation was getting hairy. You're right. Sometimes a millionaire's son has the advantage. Who would have guessed? I knew it. I mean, it's blending instinct and reality that makes a good businessman. Never trust somebody who drinks a pink margarita. Moron. Baxter has his moments. I cannot believe this. You're good, man. He wasn't a man you could back down. You'll have that to live up to. I'm pleasantly surprised with how all this worked out, Clayton. This change feels right. You're practically family, Tom. Enough of this wild business. Legacy is what we need. What time's the funeral tomorrow? 10 a.m. sharp. So we're gonna miss a whole day of work? Yeah, that's what we gotta do. Jeez, man. When I die, I hope I fall off a cliff or something, because if people are having conversations like this at my funeral, I'd be so pissed off. Chase, you probably won't care. Won't? Well, of course I'll care. What do you mean I won't care? Oh, because I'll be dead. <laughs> I get it. Yeah. That's funny. Tom, Clayton, we'll see you tomorrow. One moment, Porter. Tomorrow we'll tell some stories about your father and I and Logan Von Castro. I think it'd be good for you to hear them. Thanks for everything, Tom. It's nothing, my boy. We'll see you tomorrow. Take care. Porter! Where's he off to? <sighs> Guy's such a fruit loop. I mean, I, sometimes I just want to smack him around, you know what I mean? Yeah. I mean, what do I care if he's got a mansion? I mean, I'll keep my three-bedroom ranch if it means I don't have to go on a hike with that moron once a month. Yeah. Hey, keep, keep your head up, Porter, man. Something good's gonna happen. Everything's gonna be fine. We're gonna be okay. We're gonna stay afloat. Gentlemen. Hey, let's go golfing. I'm in. I hate golf. Who cares? You can get drunk and drive the cart. Screw Clayton Jr., man. Can we just go do something fun? All right. Let's go golf. Hey, boy. All yeah! Right. Let's go. All right, we'll follow you. All right. Okay. Oh, okay, bye. Come along, Porter. Porter! You gotta take care of this. Porter! Come on, please. I'm gonna need you to tag along tonight with Clayton. What is this? Tom, give me my space. Space? Just stop talking to me. Take a hike, TB! Oh, it's like that, is it? Yeah, it's like that, all right? Our days of sniffing in the dirt are over. Come on, Porter, let's go. Enough of this. Come on home, Porter. I am home. a boy, Porter, let's go. Let's go. Ooh. Suppose I'll have to set these boys straight. Nice work, brother, is it? You ran over his leg! No, no, I didn't. No, I didn't. Yes, you no, did! I, no. We gotta go back. No, we're not going back, Porter. We have a tea time. You cannot just leave him there! Oh, now you have a conscience, Porter. That's great. Okay. Since when do you have a conscience? He had it coming to him for a long, a long time. I know he has, but you ran over his leg. We gotta call Jordan. Yeah. So the progression was basically, Clayton Sr. died, we lost minor league baseball, you got into a fight with Tom Baxter, and then you ran over him with the truck? Yep. <laughs> Looks like I missed a good one. <laughs> yeah, but what if he calls the cops? We'll go to jail. He started it. He had it coming. He's not going to call the cops. He'll come at us in some different way. Hit us how, though? I don't know. It's Tom Baxter. He'll probably hire a bunch of Sri Lankan refugees to poison our coffee. Why are you taking this so well? Oh, I forgot to tell you. The Chinese lawyers cleaned everything up. The glass is back into production. Crisis averted. We're pretty much rich again. <laughs> wow, that is great news, man. Hey, Chase. We got the Chinese glass back on track, baby! Oh, let's go! 
Is Chase excited? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Tell him I said, yeah, baby. Hey, Jordan says, yeah, baby. That's what I'm talking about. See? This is no big deal. Just a little mess we got to clean up. All right. Get those sons of bitches. The last thing I ever do. Mm.